It's never come this far, but now a measure that would legalize medical aid in dying heads to the governor. Today, the Senate passed the measure in a 23 to 2 vote. Sarah Madison was there for that vote. Sarah? Joe, lawmakers have closely examined this issue a number of times over the past two decades. Now Hawaii is close to becoming the seventh state to allow terminally ill adults with only six months to live the option to make their own end-of-life decisions. The only two who voted against the bill were Senators Breen Harimoto and Mike Gabbard. Some lawmakers voted yes despite their concerns with how the measure is currently written. That's why those against the bill want lawmakers to take more time. But supporters say there are plenty of safeguards. It's interesting because all of the comments show again that they're very concerned this bill is flawed. And so to just pass it, just to pass it out, is we believe a danger to the community. And it's not the route to go. The time has come, and I think it was clear we have the strongest bill in the nation. Some of those safeguards include confirmation by two health care providers of the patient's diagnosis, two verbal requests and one written request from the patient, and patient counseling, which is unique only to Hawaii. The bill now goes in front of the governor, who is in support of it. If it does become law, it goes into effect January 1st. Joe.